Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. If you're looking for a job, you can log on to interview.com and you can post your resume with us. In this video, I'm going to talk about three important basic Java entry questions. What is the benefit of subclass in Java? The subclass inherits all the public methods and their implementation from the superclass. The subclass inherits all the protected methods and their implementation from the superclass. The subclass inherits all the default methods and their implementation from the superclass. The subclass can also inherit all the public protected default member variables from the superclass. Please remember the constructors are not part of this inheritance model. That means we are not inheriting constructors from the superclass. Where and how can you use a private constructor? Please remember whenever you use a private constructor, that means no no class uh, from the from outside the class nobody can in nobody can instantiate this object. Private construct can, constructor can be used if you do not want any other class to instantiate it by using new. The instantiation is done from a pub static public method. You will have a static public method. Uh, the from external they have to instantiate from external class they can they can call this method and get the instantiation which is used when dealing with factory method pattern and singleton pattern also we can use in system dot out dot println what is system out and println please explain system is a predefined final class out is a print stream object acting as a field member in the system class and println is a built-in overloaded method in the out objects so println is a method in print stream and we have a print stream object print stream object in the system class so that's what um, so system dot out dot println we are calling okay hope these three questions are useful for your java interview preparation thank you and all the best